print it. They print it out, and then they're going to sing it or chant it. And you're going to write down in here the meter signature, right? What's the meter? Is it duple or triple? And is it, uh, it doesn't matter what the key is. It just matters what the, right now, it matters what the meter is. You can put it in any key you want, notate it in C or notate it in A minor, whatever works for you. Then you, after it's kind of in there, ha hashed out, then you can make it look pretty. Right now, it's just getting it out so that it's always the same. The problem I had and still have is that if a child sings a song to me and I don't notate it, the next time the child sings the same song, it's going to be different, which is all right, but it's not the first thing. So this is to help document what the child did. Now, if you're not really um, skilled at dictation, this is basic dictation, have the child record it and then send you the recording and then you can notate it. You can take more time to notate it. The operative word here is time. This is not quick and easy because what the child is going to give you is going to be very, um, it's not going to fall into standard notation really well. There'll be a lot of syncopation. I found that to be true. If you need to go to someone who has more knowledge, a friend who does a better job at this than you do, then go to the friend. That's all that matters is getting the kids work on paper. And then you can show the child, here's your work. <laughs>